give the system a chance to work itself out. We made it this far. We are the grand experiment. We are the American democracy. Give it a chance. Some are willing to give the president's stimulus plan a chance, and some are sick of waiting. I haven't really saw or seen any improvement yet. What we have to do is put people back to work, and that's, that's the important thing, and we don't seem to be doing that. In fact, in the very city where the president will be speaking today, Columbus, workers were forced to take the day off. The hospital construction job employs hundreds of workers, and none will be at work or get paid today because the president's scheduled speech closed the construction site for the day. And we want to work tomorrow because the president's coming. And we're just wondering why, you know, because we, you know, it's $200 a day we're missing out on. Still, the president's message is that the stimulus plan is working. He'll speak at the groundbreaking of a $25 million road project paid for with stimulus money. But Republicans argue against the location of today's address. Here's a quote from RNC spokesman Ryan Tronovich. With 652,292 Ohioans currently unemployed, the president's message of tax, spend, and borrow fits about as well in Columbus, Ohio, as a Michigan Wolverine does at the Horseshoe. As far as right now, I ain't seen uh, the effects or the positive effects of whatever it is he's doing. Overall, uh, there's things that could be done better, but I, I still think he, he's doing the best he could do right now. Pete Kenworthy, News Channel 5.